Are you tired of your woman trying to run away? If so, try Sparta's shock collar. Once she puts it on, it never comes off. In a store near you, in a variety of colors for tw 20 silver minors. We interrupt this program to warn all citizens of Achilles, the most indestructible outlaw of all. I'm Barbara Stockers, reporting to you live from Troy. Achilles is wanted for the murder of our beloved Hector, who is going to be our future ruler leaving a wife to become a widow and abandoning a baby and to becoming an orphan. When Achilles' careless cousin, Patroclus, was mistakenly killed during a Trojan duel, Achilles seeked revenge. Hear what Agamemnon has to say. He's a great warrior, a killing machine. Of course I had to have him in my army. So what you're saying is, it's better to have him on your team than having him killing you. Well, uh, as I had said before, the guy is a killing machine, so... So you only used him for your own benefit, because let's be honest here, you could care less if Helen ran away or got kidnapped. You just wanted a motive to get a war, and it seemed like a perfect reason, didn't it? No, I, um, I did it for my brother. I wanted power. I wanted all of it to myself. I deserve it, and it should be all mine. No one deserves all power. Definitely not the ones that loves to kill. So in conclusion, he's just like a sword, a tool that's made to cause damage, and that's exactly what you needed since you wanted this war so badly. Thanks for stopping by. Which brings us to our next guest, Indramaki. How are you holding on? <laughs> in this time of grief, what can you say about Achilles? That man has to be put to a stop. What kind of man kills another with that if he has a family to take care of? How's my little boy going to grow up without a father? Was it really necessary to ruthlessly drag his body? Wasn't it enough to have already killed a husband, a father, and have destroyed a family? Not to mention that now our future leader is an immature child that doesn't know how to face his problems. <laughs> I'm sorry to disrupt you in such a bad time. And thank you so much for joining us today. During a tragic time, I hope everything becomes better for you in the heart in the near future. Thank you. That's the most wanted man himself, Achilles. Achilles, you had already ruthlessly killed Hector. What was the need of dragging his body? Well, um, I had to make sure he was dead. Um, is it fair to torture a body that is already put to rest? Well, he was already dead, so it wasn't like he was going to suffer or anything like that. Then why would anyone in the right mind do such a cruel thing? Pride, obviously. Something you obviously don't have. Achilles, during war, a time of life and death, all the helmets, the body armored shields, can you ever tell who you're actually killing? No, like you said, at the time of life or death, whoever or whatever crosses my path will be obliterated. Also, if they want to fight, they need to be pre prepared to die. Then what makes you possibly think Hector knew he was doing Patroclus? Look. I could care less if Hector knew or didn't know if he killed my cousin. Point is, he did it and he had to pay for it. Care? Of course not. Well, you know, he's an enemy. Who cares about enemies? They have to be eliminated. So I have to do what I have to do. I... Thank you for your time. I'm Barbara Sockers, and this is SPN.